Hello and welcome back to Scrap Mechanic. In this one, I'm showing my off-road bus. In a comment on one of my other videos, I can't remember which one, I was asked to make an off-road bus. So, I started by making standard school bus. Which I will show once I find it. Do, do. There we go. I started just by making a simple bus. It's like the school bus is near or around where I live. And then I took out the entire interior and the drivetrain and stuff. All I left was the black ducts for the uh, chassis. And then I decided where I wanted the wheels to be, by default, and then I just went from there like I usually do. It has my usual three link suspension, except for the springs are on top of the axles. There's a little issue with it that I'll get to in a second. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then this arm here drops down to compress them and give it a better ride height. And then here's the back. And the exhaust. Right now, since I don't have an actual engine in it, the exhaust just goes to the chassis. A little laggy. Why won't the hood lift up? There we go. So there you can see the bar that drops down for the suspension. And then it has the same on the rear. And here you have the, uh, the reverse light, the brake light, and the turn signal I believe. And then there's the warning lights for when the little stop sign thing on real ones, there's a little stop sign thing on here that folds out when they uh, let kids off and pick kids up. Given. Um, so for the rear, I had to put this little panel here to cover it, and then I couldn't put seats here because the bottom part, the bottom part blocked the spring from going down. But uh, so let me get rid of this block really quick. And then this is a uh, safety door, so in case you can't get out the front, you go back. And then right here is another safety door, so say it rolls over onto its side, you can still get out. And then uh, doo -doo -doo, that's basically it. On a real one, the roof would be a little bit higher, and you'd have like a first aid kit and a camera and stuff up here. And the seats are a little wider. And then the doors usually uh, fold. So it's, it's like a bifold door, I guess. This one doesn't want to close. Whatever. Come on. I'll just put it back on the hook for a second. Come on. There we go. Okay, and then I just threw the front lights on it, just so that they were there. That's what it looks like when all the lights are on. And then there would be a flashing one on top. But um, as I was saying with the suspension, as you can see, when I accelerate, it leans. And for some reason, having the... Uh, open the hood to show if I can get off the seat. There we go. Go up here. Come on. So having it like this, can't really see there, but uh, it goes, you can see the bearings. But for some reason having it like this, even though the spring is here, I guess it makes sense. But this one is rotating the axle 
this way, and this one is rotating it this way. If I had, it didn't work with them both the same way, which is why I put them opposite ways. So when I back up or reverse, back up or reverse, that's the same thing. When I go forwards or in reverse, it leans. Reverse leans right. I mean, forwards leans right, reverse leans left. It's just something I can't figure out how to fix right, right now. And the door's not closed. But anyways, I'll go to driving it. The suspension's pretty stiff. Just to help it actually uh, not bottom out and whatnot. But it, I'm surprised with not having a, uh, a sway bar and how top heavy it is. I can do full speed turns in it. Flip. And it doesn't really bottom out very much either. This side does just because it's leaning that way, but I'm just going to my little jump over there. Pretty slow, but if I up the speed anymore, the axles twist and it gets all. But, uh, I have no idea if I clear this or not. Nope. Not bad though, for how long and heavy it is. Um, it has pretty good flex too. If it would cooperate, I'll just use the lift. It doesn't want to cooperate. They need to make the wheels act like they're rubber, not plastic. But, anyways. You see the flex. Um, it's not done yet. There's still some stuff I'd like to do, like fix right here, because there shouldn't be a hole there. Um, make a little ladder. Edit the chassis a little bit. Oops. Make it a little more realistic of a chassis. I want to fix the. Uh, <clears throat> I want to fix this part so it's not sticking through the floor and. All that stuff. But yeah, there's the uh, off-road bus so far.